Hey, I just saw King Mont and the others deploy without us. You did? Phew, I'm so glad they didn't notice we were missing. It's not that they didn't notice. I doubt they count us as part of their fighting force. I'm sure that's not true. Then why did no one seek us out? Yerma, did you want them to find us in here? We gave everything we had and more in the battle for Ovis, did we not? You're right. When we first arrived in Leonis, we were probably a burden to everyone, but... We've come a long way since then. You're damn right we have. That's why we were sent here to protect this castle in the first place. But that mission is complete now, right? Wait, so does that mean they don't need us anymore? <sighs> uh. I wanted King Mont to come looking for us. Uh. Uh. It's not like we need him to bow his head and tell us we turned the tide of the war or anything like that. Yeah, it would have been nice to at least have been thanked for fighting together. I just wanted to hear someone say they were glad they had us on their side. I mean, we did more than enough to deserve it, right? And yet no one said a thing! Not a single thing! Does this mean we were just disposable cannon fodder? If that's all they think of us, then I am saying my goodbyes to Leonis. You're not planning to go after King Mont just to ask him that, are you? Of course I am. Do you take issue with that? N not at all. I want to know too, you know. Then, shall we go and see? Let's do it. The army of Rundal draws closer. How shall we proceed? I would be delighted to grace their ranks with an iron bombardment if need be. That shall not be necessary for now. Oh? They have arrived. Ah, our reinforcements. My loyal followers who were hidden throughout the Arms Dealers Guild. Interesting. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Abbott. Eldrick. I'm Lumeda, and this is... Lamega. And what of Luciel? She is safe within the Sanctum. Ah, very good. I am glad she is unharmed. There is one more thing. I am listening. We have entered the final phase of extracting magic from the crystal in Leonis. Stern accompanied the expedition. However... Has something befallen him? According to Whisper, they encountered remnants from Leonis and his allegiance had shifted. If we're unlucky, we might have to face him in this war. There is no need for such concerns. Through the golden armor he wore, I have sown a powerful malevolence into his mind. It will not be easy for them to find one capable of purging it. Which means, Stern is still as he should be, my beloved son. 
Lord Sodaly, forgive our late arrival. Why, if it isn't Comrol and Jinnok. That attire of yours. Lycoros, I take it. We are Lycoros's of Tretus. I am the commander, Comrol. This is my trusted lieutenant, Jinnok. Ah, I suppose you are here seeking revenge for your now decimated nation. You hail from Wisset. I am Abbot, commander of Styrie. The renowned artilleryman. A reassuring ally to have. It would appear everyone is ready to play their part. Your methods are yours to choose, as is the reward for the one who brings me Jaden's head. Now, take to the battlefield. Quite what I imagined. You're not wrong about that. I was expecting to see a chaotic mess of sanctum monks and Rundal soldiers. I know we were doing our best to avoid Rundal forces, but this. You don't think these chocobos were so fast that we actually ended up ahead of King Mont, do you? Perhaps it was a bad idea to convince McLeod to let us take their fastest ones. All I see is regular old villagers wandering around like they're lost. Hey, Nasha, is this really the right way? Are you trying to say you don't trust my sense of direction? Yes, and there's a good reason for it. That's so unfair! You have no idea how it feels to be forced into taking the lead! Forced? I thought that's just what so-called strongest paladins do! I can't believe we're lost in the middle of a grassy plain. Etra, your nose always knows where to go. Which direction is King Mont sent? Commander of Rundal's 2nd Division, Crucium. And this is Shunok. You are soldiers from Leonis, I take it? Um, th that's not necessarily true, you know? Am I mistaken then? What do we do? The three of us can't possibly take them all on? They look pretty villainous, too. No wonder they're from Rundal. What? I'm kind of into the one on the right. We can hear you. Ah! Do not misunderstand. Rundal has no wish to fight Leonis at this time. Huh? What do you mean? King Jaden met with King Mont not moments ago. 
He was just here! During their conversation, King Mont said that Rundall was the enemy. That sounds an awful lot like something you'd say when you're looking for a fight. He also said that he would crush Rundall, but only after the misguided people of Ardra had been saved. The misguided people? Oh, does he mean those villagers we saw wandering all over the place? That is correct. They are citizens from all corners of the land, and followers of the Sanctum. W wait a minute! Do you mean that they've sent their own followers out onto the battlefield? I do indeed. I, I can't believe it! How can they drag innocent people into a war like this? This is unforgivable. I wonder if there's any way we can help them. <laughs> Spoken like true Lions of Leonis. Your hearts are one with your kings. What? Does that mean King Mont returned to the battlefield to save the misguided? Is that why he's out here? Um... There's one thing we'd really like to ask. You don't happen to know where King Mont is right now, do you? You are in search of your king? That would be the long and short of it, yes. Our forces pursue Sadali as he makes his retreat. And this is the front line. Which means King Mont is... Somewhere behind us, I would assume. Then we really did go past King Mont and get too far ahead. Wait. Sanctum Monk's approach. Oh, you hold yourselves well in battle. Do you really think so? I am not known for my flattery. Well, we might not look it, but we're all members of Leonis's first division, Fordham, you know? Fordham? You are under Lord Stern's command. That would explain the degree to which you have been tempered for battle. You know of Lord Stern? Only the stories. They say he was trained by the hand of a samurai from the east, Sir O. That's right. He's really incredible. But no one knows where he is now. Probably with the Sanctum. All the more reason for you to emerge victorious in this war. Once Sadali is defeated, I am sure Stern will return to you. Y yeah you're right I'm not going to give up. Now going back to what you said earlier... Yes? You said that King Mont returned to the battlefield in order to save the followers of the Sanctum, right? It would appear that way, yes. But he had already suffered such grievous wounds. And yet he aims to cut his way through the warrior monks without laying as much as a finger on the followers. The followers are likely under some manner of insidious spell cast by Sonali. They appear to shamble about mindlessly, but should you let your guard down? What, they suddenly attack? Indeed. We have already lost a number of our men because of this. King Mont chose to come back to the battlefield despite knowing the danger he would face. That must be why... He deployed without saying a word to us. How very telling. 
I now understand why you seek out King Mont and his main force. Fordham is a shadow of its former self with Lord Stern lost to the winds. If the three of you were to fall, King Mont would be too shamed to face Lord Stern should he return. Thus, he did not call you to arms. Did King Mont say all that? No, it is merely my personal interpretation. <sighs> okay, come and face me! Nasha, the strongest paladin in the realm, stands in your way! Your pitiful blows are going to bounce right off the great shield of Fordham! If you're not going to make the first move, then I guess we'll just have to get things started! Lady Lilith and Lady Ramada, we meet again. Baral, is that you? Baral? I told you, right? About when I left Leonis and met Ramada. And it was during that time we both met Baral. <laughs> I believe we stood as foes that day, mind you. You said you wanted to meet a certain person from Leonis, did you not? Now's your chance. Baral of Rondal's 2nd Division Crucium. I had long wished to make your acquaintance someday. Lilith has spoken of you before. She said there was a man in Rundal who wished to see this world rid of war as much as I. I still can't fathom why someone like you would serve Rundal. Oh? I for one do not find it so confounding at all. The people of Rundal were most welcoming to me when I suddenly appeared at their gates. Not to mention King Jaden who led his troops all the way to Wazette. Be that as it may. I believe you refer to Rundal as the threat to the West. But to our eyes, the true threat lies even farther to the West. Even farther to the West? What is it that you speak of? It is little wonder that you do not know. To the west of Rundal lies a great waterfall that divides the east and west of Ardra. What is atop it? I fear I have said too much for now. But in time, you too shall encounter the threat of which I speak. <laughs> we of Rundal do not take any pleasure in the lives we must take. King Jaden also wishes to see this world free of war. Just as you do. <laughs> it has been a true honor to meet you. I hope another chance will present itself once this war is behind us. One last thing. We have received reports that reinforcements have arrived at Sodaly's side. Please be vigilant. <laughs> they want this world to be free of war? Hardly convincing when it comes from the likes of Rundal. 
It is equally as suspicious as your desire to fight in the name of others. But that, that's not true at all. I'm always honest and forthcoming. The only thing you are honest with is your own desires. King Mont, what do you think? I do not know what to make of this. But for the time being, I have no intention of pondering it further. Subtly must be defeated. That is all I wish to focus on right now. Huh? Is that you, King Mont? That voice. Woohoo! We finally made it! What are you three doing here? Raldor told us where we could find you. Raldor? As in, the commander of Rundal's second division? That's right. He was quite kind to us, despite how he looks. Lord Shunak is definitely more my type, though. This isn't the time, Masha. <laughs> Lord Stern may not be here. But we are still the First Division, Fordham. I know we may not seem all that dependable, but even Rundal praised our efforts in battle. I promise we will prove to be a great help, so please! <laughs> Thank you. Even as the gates of the castle opened in front of us, I was still unsure if leaving you behind was the right choice. It is most heartening to have you with us. Woohoo! First Division Fordham! A little late, but reporting for duty! Well said. We have been informed that Sodaly has reinforcements. However, this is no cause to falter. We must bring down Sodaly and save the lives of the innocent, no matter what. Let's go! An unnecessarily long barrage. What do you suppose it means? Could something have given rise to the enemy's morale? Perhaps the fortress has fallen. That cannot be! D does this mean we are isolated here without hopes of reinforcements? And what if we are? What kind of question is that? We will die here! Their strategy is clear to me now. It is? They wait for us to run out of ammunition. So they are firing really to provoke us? But what good will it do to know this if we are out of options? You talk too much for your own good. <sighs> How could you? Now I have a clear understanding of our foe's speed and accuracy. They are well trained. But in the end, their skills are but those of the Lowlands. The threat they pose is insignificant. <sighs> Ch 
Commander Lucia? You saw the soldier who was tossed out from behind those rocks, did you not? Of course. Do you think they turned on each other? More likely, a ploy by Melnia. She used the soldier to gauge our abilities. By sacrificing one of her own men? That's the kind of woman she is. Good gods! What now? Melia is out in the open! Then shoot her, you dim-witted fool! How pitifully slow. Perhaps I'll die of boredom. Damn it! Take her down now! It's... it's just a scratch. But... Allow me to draw their fire from us. Don't even think about it. But if we do not take action... Acting in haste will get us nowhere. Oh. Think about what we just saw. What do you mean? Why would Melnia go to such dangerous lengths just to have us fire upon her? Because she has complete confidence in her speed and prowess. Indeed. But I do not believe it to be just that. Then they must be running low on ammunition. That is a possibility. She may be pressured to put an end to this. They've stopped. She knows that we run low on ammunition. Clever girl. This Lucia is quite a fascinating presence. She possesses far greater control and cunning than I had expected. However, there are other ways to draw them from their cover. Let us see how she handles what is to come. Commander Lucia! A large group of people approach from our rear! People? Meaning they are not Sanctum Monks? No, it seems they are just followers. Followers of the Crystal Faith? Th there appear to be people from Rundal among them. And they happen to be right here, on this very battlefield. Cursed Sodaly! He has wagered we won't pull the trigger on villagers from our own nation. Ignore them for now, and focus on the foe before us, Melnia. Yes, my lady! It looks like she is in no mood to make the first move. A test of wills it is, then. The followers of the Crystal Faith are drawing closer! <clears throat> what are they doing? If they mean us no harm, why would they... It's Kirel! We've been friends since we were little. I saw Sheila too. 
She's the daughter of Stan, from the village next to mine. Even if it must be the last thing I do. have been a fine distraction. What's the matter? I thought you wanted to finish me off. I need no gun to dispose of you. What? I shall cut you apart. Renault. Sodaly has abandoned the fortress. Yes, I am aware. What about Jaden? He leads Rundal in pursuit of Sodaly. Meaning Jaden has left Lucia and her unit here to fend for themselves. Ultimately, yes, my lady. Then it is time to end our little dance. We shall take Lucia's head with us on our hunt for Jaden. Not as long as I draw breath! I'm empty! Then perish. Now, there are none left to interfere. I wouldn't be so sure about that! Wrong idea. We did not come all this way just to help you. 